What are we watching, Wayne? What are we watching? Um, Harry Potter! Magic lives on. It's behind the scenes, isn't it? How exciting. I don't like this guy, though. Alex Zane? Yeah. Mm. I used to, but I went off him. I think he's a massive cock. Oh, that's nice. Isn't he the guy who was a nature? Yeah. <laughs> How exciting. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> We're just on an ad break. So far, so good. It's actually really good. And just thought we'd let you know what's been. Is it back already? No. No, she's advertising the channel. Today we went to town, didn't we? And what did we do? Why did we go into town? Oh. I had to sort my ring out because it was broken, which it shouldn't be, obviously. Uh, and I'm not quite sure how it broke because it was in a really, really awkward place. We needed to get it replated because um, the white gold bit at the bottom had um, lost its colour. And then at some point I also need to get it cleaned. But I don't know if they're going to clean it or not because they may actually just give me a new ring depending on um, repairs and all that jargon. Um, so at some point we'll be having to go back and get that. Tomorrow we are going to where are we going oh, i've got my meeting <laughs> got your meeting i don't know uh, i've got a meeting at midday about yeah some work experience mm -hmm. tutoring of the peoples yeah because wayne at some point wants to become a college slash uni tutor in um, art specifically art or the fine art or the finest of the, the arts. finest of the arts um so obviously he needs to have work experience before he can actually go into said position uh so obviously he'll be doing that while he's studying uh so he's got a meeting tomorrow about that and then while we're out what are we doing we're gonna get a canvas yeah he wants to go get a canvas from work they've put one aside for him uh for some yeah preliminary work that he wants to sort of start doing uh, before he starts uni fully. So I think that's what we're doing tomorrow. And yeah. This will probably be Monday's entry. Yes, yes. Good day. <laughs> the foot bit yet oh that's so cute that it rotates but yeah she's a little bit um small for it although it's apparently from birth but um hello 
<laughs> she loves it, which is good. Look at you. <gasps> Hello. Hi. Good morning. I literally woke up like this. <laughs> At the moment, I am making some fresh purees for Bella. I have just got a bag of carrots. Uh, I have peeled them. I'm about to wash them, chop them up, put them in a saucepan for boiling so that they're nice and mushy, and then a hand blender to blend them down into a pulp. And then I'm gonna put them into little uh, puree pots to stick in the freezer. So that any time that we want to um, give her some pureed food for lunch or for dinner, uh, we just take out a pot, microwave it, and done. She's ready to have her lunch or her dinner. Um, the food that she's been eating recently are the Ella's Kitchen Pouches. They're really good, really handy, but I think we're going to just use them more as a last minute resort or for travelling and then um, use our sort of homemade ones. Um, more regularly. You excited to go to the depot, Wayne? Yeah, I'm uh, thrilled. I'm gonna get drenched. <laughs> We're having to go to the bloody depot because parcels get re delivered on days that you've not asked for them to be re delivered, like the day after. Uh, so, yeah, that's happening. Um, the carrots are cooked, they're in there, but we've got to go to the depot. So, I'm leaving them with the lid on and the water just to soften them up a bit more and then when I get back I'm gonna um, hand whisk them and then get them into the pots to put in the freezer. just received the two replacement products from um, Nature Soap Handmade Cosmetics. Uh, this is the one that I had in the delivery that I reviewed or should I say that I unboxed um, on this channel and this is the replacement so you can see that um, because of the heat in transportation it basically became like a, a mush. If you look inside you can see they're completely different consistencies. This is like little balls of mush and then this one is literally just like salts and what is it again uh calendula petals lemongrass and peppermint and essential oils and stuff like that so yeah that's definitely a lot more appealing than that one so definitely the weather got to that so i'll be using that one today i'm going to attempt to try and use all of these products today they also replaced my body sugar scrub and once again you can tell which one got affected by the heat and which one is the new one so heat and new one so again i'll be using that one and giving you a review of that too in terms of soaps i will be using this one which is the lemon and meichang goat's milk soap and i'm also going to use the, I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but it's the bath melt with palma rosa and orange. And how do you do that? I think you just, 
uh, yeah, drop the bath mat into the bath and let the natural butters work their magic. Uh, but yeah, I'll just kind of show you guys me putting this into the bath and then I'll let you know how it is. And then I'll be using the lip balm and the body butter after my bath too. very flattering angle in terms of lighting but anyway uh, just got out of the uh, bath and um, I'm just putting my converse on so that we can go to the shops and I just thought I'd give you a rundown of the products that I used so my favorite products were the bath salts the moisturizer and the lip balm all very nice um, the two that I was a bit not so sure about um, were the body scrub and the bath melt. This is only because um, they're very, they've got a lot of essential oils in, um, like a fair amount. Um, when I put the uh, bath melt in, there was sort of like a layer on top of um, the bath, which a lot of oily products do. Um, but with my skin being quite oily already, um, it just added fuel to the fire, so to speak. So I'm um, not a fan of those, but if you have dry skin, definitely recommend it because it would do your skin wonders um i think that was it wasn't it i don't think there was anything else oh the soaps again the soaps were very oily um so again i'd recommend it for anyone who has dry skin but other than that very good didn't have any weird reactions smelt heavenly especially the bath salts which when i opened them to review them they were really strong already so in the bath with the hot water they were amazing so yeah definitely a thumbs up i'll leave all the links down below including the package that i received and yeah get ordering if you have dry skin definitely a good one for dry skin it's really fine i'm like squinting this is what death feels like but the lighting's better that way oh yeah wayne's ill told you we'd catch it <laughs> me and bella are fine now though so i'm hoping that we don't recatch it I'm going to close these blinds. Can you close that one? Because it's very, um... Obtuse. No, not obtuse. It's <laughs> very bright. Today, Wayne is working, aren't you? Till... You'll get about home about four, four, depending on um, trains. Because it's bloody Sunday. I hate Sunday trains. I am waiting for my Harry Potter and the Cursed Child parts one and two. Um script book um oh they're both in the same book <coughs> yeah i think so i've already seen some people on twitter commenting on like them being still on the first chapter and it's already amazing so i'm mucho as excited yesterday when i went to work i was at home with my sister and then um he watched the football nothing really happened did it this week's been a bit of a quiet week we've not really done much have we um we've just chilled Bella, who's that? Is that you? You're very smiley today, aren't you? Who's are you? <laughs> it's fun to stay at the YMCA. You like that song, don't you? It's got a bogey. Yeah, I can see it. You got a little crusty. A little crusty. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's arrived I'm so excited and I can't even start it until Wayne gets home um uh, I haven't even like read the blurb or anything I've heard there's like secrets in here and things happen and it's all very exciting so yeah I just want to get into this and I can't <gasps> oh I really want Wayne to hurry up and get home <laughs> I really like books like this actually without the um paper cover i just think they're a lot more kind of i don't know 
a little bit more mysterious like you wouldn't say that was Harry Potter would you but it is so yeah looking forward to that when I start reading it um, I'll let you guys know obviously without any spoilers um, how we're doing with it what we think of it if you have read it already which I'd be very surprised it's only been out a day although some people are very quick readers or if you've seen the play let me know what you think again without any spoilers um, because oh, I'm hoping this is good I'm so hoping this is good hello hello little baby how are you what are you doing there you just having a good old chill out yes yes oh so excited may I also just point out that I have dressed myself today in full-on Harry Potter merch without even realizing it I've got Hufflepuff socks on I've got these um, tracksuit bottoms from um, Primark that have like Hogwarts all over them and like Harry Potter down the side and then I've got my Hogwarts t-shirt like seriously everything is Harry Potter today